Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Callie and today we are back with Pokemon Legends Arceus and I am super hyped. We are back with Pokemon Legends Arceus and I'm super excited to jump right, but what sees me? Like, I'm confused. Oh, the Remoraid. Sorry, Remoraid. I'm very excited to be back into this. Let me actually look at my, no. I do this every time, I never know where my goals are. We are here to look at my goals. Where are my goals? I think last time we had to complete more of our Pokedex to level up, um, to get our new, enough research tasks to rank the fourth star so that we can go to the next area. So we are just out catching Pokemons and doing Pokedex things. Cause I think I have a lot of stuff to do in this area. So that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna do more of that. A t -t talking Pokemon, help, help, help. So stay away, stay away. Ugh, why is this Pokemon talking? Talk, talk. Um, I would love a Shatot. Considering, you know, it's coming from Parrot Girl over here. Far from it, help me. Hi Shatot. Oh, he's so cute. No, Shatot's so cute. We're gonna catch him, because I like him. Why do I have three Pokemon missing? Did I die that many times last time? Yeah, we need to heal. Okay, so let's, um, we should be able to... Aerial Ace shouldn't do anything, because we're both flying types. Okay, yeah, and then I'm gonna try to catch him, because I think that I need to, um, fill up my Pokedex with him anyways. So let's go ahead and throw a Pokeball. Please stay in my wall, you're super cute. I didn't know Shatok could talk. Is that like a thing, like in the anime and in um, the Pokedex? Because never heard of that one before. Oh my gosh, Decidueye needs to be leveled up. Thank goodness, I don't know if I'd survived without you. No one told me there'd be Pokemon that talk like people out here. What a fright! You sound like a hoe. Back where I grew up, folks often said that if you hear someone talk when nobody's around, it's not a ghost playing trick, it's just a shatot. Anyway, thank you kindly. I had the whole wrong voice. I thought it was him talking. Anyway, thank you kindly for finding Yorick. I'll have him set up a camp now. Hup, two, ready and lift. And lift, and lift. Ooh, can I um, heal my Pokemon here? Cause I need to do that. Oh, cool. All finished. I'm sure that awful voice I heard mimicking me was just my imagination. I owe you big time, young Survey Corps recruit. Come take a rest here at the camp any time you'd like. Lavington, can I just rest? What a splendidly scenic base camp. This ought to be quite convenient for surveying Pokemon that live on the waterfront. Okay, it'd be convenient if I could f freaking rest. Because I only have a certain amount of Pokemon. Yeah, that's what I needed. All right, let's go catch some more ish. I really would like to catch um, some water Pokemons. Let's, um, no. These controls down here are really confusing. I always get them mixed up. Wait, where's the, I don't see an alpha. Cause there an alpha in the water. Can I get me this rumor raid? me freaking turd oh what's this can I have a Pokemon get it like what do I do here get it <laughs> why is Decidueye literally the same height as me and what are these a grain cake and ultra oh what an ultra ball Aww. Aww. sorry that was unnecessary to me. Is there anything in here that I can get rid of? Like, what, are, what is the stuff that I don't need? It is loved by certain Pokemon, incompatible with everybody. Firestone is in. Oh, can I use that Firestone? Does Magmar evolve with a Firestone? I have a Magmar. Ponytail, I'm not gonna lie, I may be getting rid of you. Swore Cap will consume. I need to, um, 
I need to start crafting more, but the thing is, is like I have so much of certain items that like I don't have the other half of it to craft. I think you know what I'm trying to say. A lost satchel. Sit back to Ava. Thanks for helping. Well, who the hell's Ava? Can I catch this Remoraid? Like, on, on, okay, you know what? Remoraid and me. Here, Decidueye, can you handle this? I didn't know we could battle. Oh, he flies. Look at Decidueye go. Okay, bud. Um, let's just do Aerial Ace. Is that gonna kill him? Yes. <laughs> the answer is yes. I did not want to do that, but that also helps me complete the Pokedex, so I guess, like, sure. We already have Starly completed in a Pokedex, so I'm not super worried about Starly. But, like, a lot of these water ones, we don't have a lot on. Look, there's another crate. Oh, it's a giant Starly Alpha. What is your level? What level are you? He's a star. Oh, look at him. He's so cool. Oh my goodness. Ma'am. Chill. Yeah, that did nothing. Yeah, he's about to wreck me. Okay, um... Let's roost. It didn't restore all my- I thought it restored all my HP. Are you kidding? Okay, Starly. Chill, dude. I don't think- I don't think Aerial Ace should kill him. It shouldn't. Dang it! I wanted to catch him. Okay, so we can try to, try to catch a Remoraid over here, maybe? That guy looks like he's on my boots already. Oh my gosh, why are you so on it? Look. Um, okay. Graveler should not kill him. <laughs> Look, he's floating! Look at him go! Okay, look. Rock sliding. That should not kill him. I know we're really over leveled, but... <laughs> Am I just not meant to have a Remoraid? Is that what this really is about? We're gonna spend the entire episode trying to catch a dang Remoraid. Okay. Are you kidding? But it's like they're never close enough for me to get them. Okay, look. We're gonna try something else here. Floatzel, go. I'm just trying so hard. I will say that I like that they have a different animation for every um, Pokemon that goes in the water. So like Floatzel stands in it, Decidueye flies above it, Graveler has a raft. Hilarious. Okay, remember, you're gonna get in this freaking ball and you're gonna like it. If he doesn't stay in this ball, I'm gonna quit. <laughs> Okay, he got it. About time. Oh my god, there's two of them. Floatzel, go! So we know that you don't kill him. So a quick attack doesn't kill. We're good to use a quick attack. Oh! What was that? Did we get a crit? There's no way. Look, Remoraid. Get in this ball, dude. Get in the bowl. So my next question is, is, you know how in the last area that we were in, I think it was Crimson Myrlands, they had a Turtwig and a Grottle like tucked away in like this tiny little area. And my question is, is there any tiny little areas in this, what do you call it, this map area that we can explore to find some more unique Pokemans. Thirteen wisps in this area? Are you kidding? What do I look like? Oh my god, that scared me. I thought I was done for. <laughs> Actually, 
So I was gonna go all the way out there, but let me just go back to the camp to refresh real quick. What's right here? Can I catch it? A mantine or a mantite? Mantine's the the big boy. Quick tech shouldn't kill. We're on a roll with Floatzel, so yeah, I could probably do another one to be honest. We're gonna try a Pokeball. Oh my gosh, what did he do me for, dude? What did you gain from hurting me like that? <laughs> I'm on a roll, you guys. The end of last episode, I really felt like I was struggling to um, catch things and be a Pokemon master. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. I felt like I was really struggling to catch things, is the moral of the story. And it was like everything was just not going as planned. I couldn't find things and I didn't know how to, yeah, no, I'm on a roll today. Let's just call it what it is, a roll. Just for a little while. I just want to refresh my pokies. I'd actually like to maybe catch some more ghost type. Okay, hi. Hi. Thank you. I don't know why you did that, but thank you. I appreciate it, question mark. I feel like there is a, well, there's a quest. You know, Remoraid, come back. This may be my chance. You freaking, you're part of the Survey Corps, right? Could you help me out? Oh, sad little Piplup, no, don't be sad. It seems this Pokemon's so hungry that it can barely even move. He's moving a lot, actually. I tried giving it food, but it won't take a bite. I don't know if it's being stubborn or what. It showed me some interest in plump beans, but it w still wouldn't eat them. Oh, of course. If we make plump beans extra tasty, I'm sure this little deer will eat them. What kind of supply corp member am I going to, if, am I to completely forget about crafting? In any case, maybe bean cakes will do the trick. Could you make me one? If you need the recipe, you can find it at the Craftworks. Um, I don't know where that is. What is, what is the craft works? Am, did I, am I supposed to know this information? Um, hold on. I'm doing a brain right now. Crafting kit, craft. Is it in here? Okay, so next time I go back, I guess I have to get this rest. Oh, that's the Chansey that I wrecked last time. So I gotta get the recipe next time I'm out and about in the... Okay, we're gonna get you, Remoraid. Are you frick fracking patty whacking? I swear to God. What's in this? In the tumble stone. The Geodude. Get him. Wrecked. I'm rude. I am disrespectful. Ugh. Okay. Let's hop on you and get to skating. What's that? Is that a plant? Bro, Driftbloom, you did not see me. Chill out. Why are you always on my boots like that? You did not see me. You just went up front like you did. But these drift blooms have like ultra senses. And of course he moves that way. Bro, come here. Look. Get got. Stay in there. I'm really being disrespectful now. <laughs> Is that a Dusk Dwar? Oh, chill out, Callie, chill out. That's a Dusk Noir. Sorry, I'm saying it like really weird. Give me that, since you're just in my way. Can I catch you? Like off the jump? Come here. You're not gonna stay in, but like, it's worth a shot. I 
want you. Okay, no, he's not gonna come around that way. So if I come over here, you are not about to see me, right? Is that a lit? I thought that was a Litwick down there. Then I realized Litwick's not even in this generation. I don't think he is. He's not in this generation, is he? Okay, yeah, no. I'm not catching you off rip. <laughs> okay, okay, chill, 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 chill. Everybody chill. There's a lot of dust skulls and I want them. Ah! Okay, thank you, Basque Legion. Okay, how do we get, how do we get back up? <gasps> Look at the quillfish. Hi, quillfish. Can you get in my ball? <sighs> I can't have nice things. Float, so will you handle this? Because I think we can catch a couple more of them. Oh, that did absolutely nothing, okay. Yo, chill. Quillfish, unnecessary. Now, I hope this crunch doesn't kill you. Okay, apparently quillfish are indestructible. I might switch to a quillfish. Okay, Floatzel's done. Sorry, Floatzel, I didn't mean to do that to you. Flotzel, Floatzel. I did not mean to battle another time. I just wanted to catch him. Oh, garbage. Okay, you know what? Quillfish, stop. Dude! Okay, everybody is wrecking me. It's just time to... God, good golly. Everybody, quit bullying me. I gotta go back to this camp that's apparently way the heck over here now. And what happened to my beautiful music? Dun, 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 dun. I'll sing it. It's light outside. Can y'all go back to sleep? You're ghost. Go back. Go. Go. What is this? Item storage. Craft? I have a crafting thing. I don't need... I need, like, the... I guess I could store some stuff. I don't know. Well, I don't think it matters. It's like, I have to go get the recipe anyways. So, Starly's by day. Duskull's by night. Look at the chatots! I love chatots. They're so cute. I just realized that chatot is like parrot and chatty at the same time. These freaking beautiflaws are about to wreck me. Beautiflaws are rude. You'd think that they'd be like sweet. No, they're rude. Big boy gold up. I like how the side I just straight up wanted to be my friend and I'm like, no, get in my Pokeball. Get in here, big boy. Get in there. We're catching everything. Straight disrespect. Oh, he was heavy. I called him big boy too. Hilarious. Hey. I'm trying to catch you. Stop. Can't have nothing. How do I get out of here? There's, I'm not going the right way. I know that. I thought there was like a little crevice that I came through because this is where the ship is. I thought there was like a little crevice that I entered in through. Oh, it's over here. Looks like I don't walk through this water area. Togepi. No! Okay, no, let's not do that. But we can get caught. How about that? Hi! Dang it, are you kidding? I wanted a Togepi. <sighs> I can't never have nothing. Uh... I just wanted to catch- I have so many star leaves, but I just wanted to catch you for GP. I literally have seven star leaves. 
But the only Star Raptor, I don't have any um, Star Ravias or Star Raptors other than mine. So maybe. Maybe. That's a good idea. Oh. Now you see me. Now you don't. Get in this ball. Man, uh, you know, life ain't fair. I want nice things and I can't have them. How many A-palms do I have? Like freaking six? Hello, A-palm. You're trying to get blasted. <laughs> Oh. I would actually like to have an ambi palm. I've never used an ambi palm. Bro, chill. Why am I getting wrecked by a palms? I'm gonna catch your cousin. I have four of them, that's a lot. Okay. I'm sure I have a lot of weasels too. But I'd only have, are you kidding? I was trying to catch you too. Uh... Well, he just ran up on me. I'm gonna need you to back up, dude. Wait, has this formed yet? Is this forming or is it? Oh. 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 Okay. I'm gonna go play around in here until that completely forms. We might be able to catch some good stuff in there and also lose half of our team in the process. So like, you know, I'm ready. It's what I live for. Let's get us some more man tanks. He ran. I applaud you for not wanting to um, have confrontation, but can I please battle you? I would really like to catch you. Okay, we can do one more quick attack. Is Mantike flying? Mantike is flying, isn't he? I was about to say, like, why did he just use Aerial Ice? But now that I think of it, I think he's one of those ones that is like a weird typing that like you don't expect. I think he's like water flying. I need to Google that. Like now I'm second guessing myself. Is he water flying? Sorry, my computer signed out on me here. All right, man tyke typing. Water flying, yeah, I was right, okay. I don't know why I remember really weird things like that, like man tykes freaking typing, like, why do I know that? Oh, he's so cute! Oh, poor guy. I might use a man tyke too. Like, I'm like putting together a new team in my head. Not that I want to get rid of any of my teammates because I've had them for so long now and I've used, I've never used some of them. But like there's a lot of Pokemon on here I've never played as. And I really want to use them. And I'm actually going to, what is that? Oh, that's an item that they dropped. I was like, what the heck? I'm actually going to try to catch some more Octillaries. Oh uh, wait, Space Temp Distortion is here. Let's go. Um, I'm going to switch to Graveler. Yes, go little man tyke, go! Okay, I have Carnivine, I have a gun tank, I think. I'm not really worried about you guys. Can I get something like really cool and unique? What is that? Do I have you? It's just gun tanks. And Magneton. Do I have, you know what, look. 
I don't want carnivines. I'm not worried about carnivines. I have like six of those already. I'm so cool. Like if I have to battle you, can I? I don't want to battle all of them as well. I would like to just battle. Oh, oh a Kadabra or an Alakazam! Shut up. Shut up. I want the Alakazam. No, go away, Carnivine. I just want Kadabra. I don't want you. No, um. Can I just try a Pokeball off the off the rip? There's he knocking, he's gonna escape. Please stay. Freaking turtlenecks! He's enraged. Are you kidding? Oh my god, he's gonna lose it. Yeah, no. We're done. We're out of here. I don't know why I tried. Yeah, we're gonna run away. Yeah, let's let's get on our um Yeah. Let's go. Let's let's skedaddle. Yikes. Um, let's go back and see. First of all, I'm gonna heal here and then we're gonna go back and see if I even have enough Pokedex to qualify for whatever they call it, the rank four. Is that what I need? Rank four? And then we'll be able to at least do some story for this episode. Oh, hello, Graveler, how are you doing? Yes. Me too. <sighs> oh, I caught a lot! I didn't know I caught a gold dog. Go me. Oh, oh, it seems you've made some new observations. Let's have a look then. Most illuminating, I'll update our Pokedex with this new data. Sphere. Okay, well, um, my question is, can I go back and... Yay! I earned the promotion! Righto, with the Survey Corps escorting us, it'll be a nice, safe trip back to Jubilife. Let's do it. Let's go! Oh yeah, let's go. Do -do 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 -do. I can't wait to see what new Pokemon are in this new area. <gasps> Can I have him? Yes, have you made progress on your research tasks? If you have progress to report, I will judge its worthiness. Show me your Pokedex. Girl. Hmm. You have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. <laughs> I'm only at four stars. Wow, I feel like I should be higher than that, but hmm, who am I? With this, you have officially attained the rank of fourth star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. You can now use leaden balls. No, I can't because guess who doesn't have enough space in their bag? Pokemon of up to level 50 will also obey your orders reliably in battle. The rewards you earn for your survey reports will be more generous now, too. Have these as well. They are further recipes you'll need for crafting. Okay. 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 Continue to dedicate yourself to completing the Pokedex if you hope to raise higher in the ranks. Your current rank qualifies you to conduct research in the Cornet Highlands, but you will need help from a particular person to survey and ultimately quell this electrode. Go to the training grounds. You should find them there. Do I have to? Because I really, really would just like to see what new Pokemon there are. And please, for the love of God, update my bag. No, this isn't the update bag, guy. There you are. You're the one, right? The one they've been talking about? The Survey Corps kid that's been exploring the Crimson Mirelands? My younger sister Wanda is in the Survey Corps, you see, and she went to the Mirelands too, but she never made it back. You managed to track down that Arizu woman in those boggy Mirelands, right? So could you find my sister Wanda? If you're planning on using Pokemon to find her, hmm, would her favorite kerchief maybe help? I'm counting on you. Please find Wanda wherever the Myrlin she's ended up. Yeah, I don't have time for that. Sorry. I just need to update my bag. I thought you were this guy. Six 
thousand? Are you kidding? That's why I stopped doing this. Oh my gosh. Like, I could literally only do it like three times and I'm out of money. Oh my god, and he just keeps jacking the prices up. You freaking... What do they call it? Gouger. He's gouging my pockets. <laughs> I don't have enough money. So let's go to this stupid training grounds because I at least want to get to the next section and see what we got going on. So we spent half the section just getting things. Hello, Callie. This gentleman is Warden Ingo, who serves Sneasler. He will guide you to our domain. Who's Sneasler? Like a Sneasel? Pleased to properly meet you. I apologize for that abrupt how do you do before. I am Warden Ingo. I understand you'll need a hand from Sneasler in order to meet Electrode. Whether she'll be fit to help you, however, we can only find out by making the journey. Now, let's have a safe journey to Mount Coronet. All aboard! Inko's a bit like you, you know. No, he's not. <laughs> Look at us. Actually, we're both wearing blue. He appeared one day from who knows where. Once more, much of his memory seems to be missing. Maybe traveling with you will help fill in some of the gaps in his memory. In any case, I'm glad to have you help to count on you will a little bit. I get so tongue-tied when I read. I'm glad to have your help to count on once again, Callie. Good luck up in the Highlands. Where I'm from, we have an area of town called the Highlands, and that is where all the bars are and restaurants. Okay, so where do we need to go? Can I? I can't travel there yet because I don't have, um, oh, it's right here. <laughs> I was like, um, did we already go here? Why is it on my map? No, we didn't. Obsidian Fields Crimson Mirelands was my second one. And there you are, my girl. Welcome to the Coronet Highlands. I expect you'll find all sorts of rock type and ground type Pokemon wandering about these craggy, boulder strewn heights. And up there, right beneath that great rift in the space time, is the peak of Mount Coronet itself. The magnetism from it may well exert some sort of influence on Pokemon throughout the area. Fascinating stuff. Alright, well, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and head out. Because I just want to see what the heck is here. Okay, who's this dingleberry over here? Bruma? How you doing? <laughs> Alright, so what's our first encounter? I'm going to get my Pokeballs ready. I don't see anything just yet. But I don't want to go too nuts because, well, there's something in this tree and I swear to God if it's a Burmy. What is it? It's a freaking Burmy. Mm. We're gonna catch it anyways. Um, I think everything that I have is gonna wreck this Burmy. Oh, he avoided the attack? Okay, stealth god. Burmy, chill, G. I figured that as such. But, um, I was not sure. Oh, Alexio! So I already have Alexio. I'm using the Lux Ray right now, but my question is, is, is my Pokedex full for Luxio? Because I don't think it is. I've only ever had one, I think. So we might as well catch him while we're out here just to fill up the Pokedex. Oh, it's snowing. Okay, yeah, no, he's peeved. Okay, he's mad. I'm going to leave him be. I'm actually going to go up this way. And there's more Luxios. Oh, Yanmas. So we've already had Yanmas. Oh, that's a Luxray. Well, good thing I came up here because we have that at least. Yeah, I know. I know, Bubby. Kelly. <laughs> Chill. Okay, Luxrays. Yeah, where'd she go? Where'd she go? She snuck down here to catch some Yanma. 
Pro. Okay, Luxray. All right, I'm gonna get wrecked. I'm gonna get wrecked. I'm gonna get wrecked. Let's just skedaddle for now. We're gonna go to the other side of the bridge area thing. There are more Luxrays over here. Or Luxios. Gosh, my brain is hurting. More Parasect? Oh my god. I have all of these. I have nothing new. Nothing new. Can you let me be? Oh my god. Nobody's bothering you. Let me be. Like, I'm literally just trying to get over here to see what's out. And I'm just getting destroyed. And it's rude. That's a Yon Mega. I don't think I have a Yon Mega. Hey. Are you freaking kidding me, stupid tree? Tree! Yes, get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah, yeah, get in there. Yeah, yeah. Hey, big girl, make it bang it up. Hey, wanna bang it up. Hey, big girl, wanna bang it up. Hey, gonna bang it up. Oh my gosh. That looked more intimidating than it was. I think that's gonna kill him. No, okay, 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 okay. Bro, chill. I'm gonna send Luxray out for right now. Do we have like something I can just paralyze? Okay, yeah, let's do Thunder Wave. I don't wanna hurt him. I just wanna get a better chance that I catch him. Yon Mega, I'm gonna need you to chill. Okay, get in there. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. That's it. Yon Mega was caught. Yay. Now, if only we didn't have to go through all of that to get him. Now, my question is, do I only have Paris or do I have Parasex as well in the um, box? Or in my Pokedex? Hey, buddy. Can I catch you? Okay, I have a lot of Yamas already. But like I said, the, the point of me catching everything while I'm out here is so I don't have to do what I did last time when we had so many issues moving forward and I had to spend half of two episodes just trying to catch up. There's no way you can see me. Okay, you can see me. You little freaking ish. I'm gonna go down here next, so... Looks like the best route of attack is down this way. Hold on. Can we get us a gold bat without being bothered by luxuries? Bro, okay. Why does everybody hear me before I get up on them? It's rude. You know what? Here, have some freaking berries. No? Okay, no berries. Hi. Ah! I thought you were gonna be nice. You weren't. You're being mean. I'm not happy about it. Zubat, would you like a berry? No, nobody wants my berries. Everybody wants to hurt me. Nobody wants my berries. Look, just be nice. Please just leave me alone. Can I feed these gold bats? Gold bat, eat my berry! So you're telling me you want no part of my, me or my berries. Because I don't believe it. He doesn't seem like he's interested in my berries. And I only think that I have one gold bat, so I'm gonna try to catch him. Can I not? Like, what's the issue? Oh, is he sleeping? What a good boy. Oh, I have 
three gold bats, apparently. He could have swore I didn't have any, but okay. Sight jokes on me, right? If I dive in here, will I get Vascalege? Dude, chill out, Golbat. Chill out. Will I get Vascalesian? Can I sail through there? Are there Pokemon in the water? It doesn't look like it, but... Yo, don't get wrecked. So no new Pokemon, I'm disappointed. That Electrode, known as the Lord of the Hollow, is somewhat different from the Electrode I recall. But its electrical discharges, at least, are familiar. One false step around it could put you in danger. If you're going to face it, you might consider catching Pokemon that can withstand electricity. It must be difficult being a Pokemon, don't you think? Especially one as irritable as Electrode. Then becoming frenzied to boot. So true, it's a tough old life for Pokemon and humans alike. Well, well, Warden Ingo of the Pro Clan, and oh my, the Galaxy Team Grunt from before. You're punching well above your weight to seek out the Great Electrode, Lord of the Hollow. But by the sheer tenderness of my heart, I'll grant you a trial to see if you're worthy. The greatest obstacle you'll ever face waits right here. Battle me if you dare. Well then, let me tell you that the great Melly's take on this whole situation, the frenzy of our nobles, is nothing other than a mark of the Almighty Sinna's favor and protection. Why? Because it makes them stronger. Do I really need to spell out that that's a good thing? We must let my lord frenzy as it may to demonstrate to Almighty Sinna that the Diamond Clan lives as right and good. This may even be, dare I say it, the very reason I am here on this earth. Is she a villain? It's giving villain. <laughs> it's giving villain. <laughs> what business is it of the galaxy teams anyway if Electrode lets loose a few sparks out here in the mountains? Really, you should do us all a favor and slink back home to that village of yours rather than per persist in this folly. And with that, bon voyage. We should have wrecked her when we had the chance. What a selfish outlook. These frenzies cause the Pokemon themselves such suffering. But what is it you want, Callie? I'm going. First of all, I'm about to whoop this girl's butt, if I'm going to tell you honestly. Very well. The tracks ahead will be perilous, but I pride myself on safe driving. To meet Sneasler, Callie, you must pass through here, Wayward Cave. Here you'll find Pokemon like Golbat and their ilk, which are quite at home navigating in the dark. It's quite dim inside, so you'll need to watch your step. Do I need flash? <laughs> flash, might you say? Well, this is odd. The torches that light the way through the cave are gone. Could this be Melly attempting to obstruct us? Either way, there's no need for concern. I know my route and I'll conduct us safely. No darkness nor foul weather will delay us. Onward we roll. Take care to not come uncoupled from me. Well, um, I'm not a nincompoop, so I think I'll be okay. I recall faintly that I had a partner once, a precious one. Its name escapes me, but I remember that it wielded flames with mastery. If only it were here, I'm sure it would light the way, luring us onward. I have a ponyta. Please forgive the unscheduled stop. I detect an alpha crobat on our right. Under normal circumstances, I doubt its presence would obstruct someone so competent as you. But given poor visibility, I propose a track and change in the interest of safety. Please follow me. Take care not to come uncoupled from me. I'm starting to recall a man who looked like me. We'd battle and discuss Pokemon, I think. The words I like winning more than anything else flashed through my mind just now. We'll soon be arriving at Wayward Cave's exit. I want to look around, but whatever. Even if the memories themselves have faded, it appears much still lives on in my heart. This is fine progress. We're nearly home free. Wait, could those be? Mm -hmm. 
Let me put those torches back where they belong. This darkness could be perilous for the next person to pass through here. I beg your pardon for the delay. I have lit the returned torches. My safety concerns have been addressed. Ready for departure. If you follow the track marked by the torches, you'll remain, you'll reach the terminus of this cave. So he just ditches me. Rude. Okay, what's in here? Is there anything in here that I can catch? And I'm not gonna lie, good freaking golly, I can't see ish. And you're telling me the crowbat just dipped? I don't believe it. Hello, Golbat. I would rather just not be bothered with you. So if you could just leave. Professor Laventon told me how you fell to the land from the sky. For my part, I simply found myself one day here in Husui, a region whose name I'd never heard. All I could remember was my own name. I was still standing there in bafflement when the Pearl Clan came to my aid. I showed a natural affinity for taming Pokemon, which is why I eventually became a warden. But I still wonder what my true purpose is here. Ah, but now I've sidetracked us with this talk. Let's hurry onward. Okay, are there any new Pokies in this area? I see Golduck, Psyduck, Crobat, and Paris. And I swear if that's all that's over here, I'm going to be heavily disappointed, but I see a Wisp, but I would really like to get it. You see that all the way over there? And then, uh -huh. But I'm actually probably just going to go ahead and end the episode here. This is a long, 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 long episode. Um, longer than I normally do. So I'm going to go ahead and save it here. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys leave a like. Also, make sure you guys comment on the video and make sure you're subscribed to the channel for more content. Also, make sure you guys are following me on Twitter at CallieCatPurr. That will be in the description below and at the beginning and the end of the video. No, I lie. It'll be throughout this video because this one actually has a layout. <laughs> so make sure you guys follow me on Twitter for all my updates and I will see you guys 